You've had three movies this year, which, okay, in and of itself is an accomplishment, but three great movies, like three of the best movies of the year. Well, thanks, Janelle. Well, how did, I mean, how'd you do that? <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. Well, I'm glad you think that. But, like, you can like something on the page and it doesn't always turn out the way you hoped. Yeah. Did you know that these were good films that were going to work out? Well, I don't think you ever really know. But, for instance, with this, it's like George, you know, I mean, you could look at George's track record and, you know, you kind of know that he's going to, what kind of movie he's going to make. She's threatening to release the story. How did she find out? Don't play dumb, Tom. You think I leaked it to her? Yeah, who else? Yeah, I didn't leak it to her, Steve. Well, I know I didn't, so that leaves you. Okay, well, what does she know? She knows whatever you told her. Did you tell anyone? No, did you? No. Did you admit to meeting with me? No. All right. Then we stonewall her and she's got nothing. She's gonna take the story to Drudge or to Roll Call. She's trying to blackmail me. She wants info about Thompson. Well, then tell her what she wants to know. What was the hardest scene for you to shoot in this movie? I mean, the whole film was a challenge because I was working with a lot of my favorite actors and I was trying to be in the scenes with them, but I was also fighting wanting to just watch them, you know? I like get my picture with them. But I realized I was getting my picture with them, in a way. So you're still like a, a fanboy geek in some ways with these guys? Yeah, it was hard for me not to fan out. And I don't think I did a very good job. I think I was pretty, I fanned out. I'll be, I'll, I'm getting it, I'm getting, I'll, I'll get it. Who haven't you met that you would totally geek out on? Uh, I'd like to meet Michael Jordan, you know? Sometimes you meet your heroes, it's not great. Like the Ultimate Warrior was my hero when I was a kid. You know, it was the first poster I ever had on my wall. And I waited for him outside of the arena. And I asked, I took my poster, I asked him for his autograph. He said, he said, he said, not now, kid. And I was like, Ultimate Warrior. Sorry, I don't mean to laugh. That's actually heartbreaking. Yeah, it was, it, just, it was the worst. <laughs> Um, I assume you didn't audition for this. This is like a situation where George called you? Yeah. It's one of those things where George Clooney calls you and then you, ha you, you, you say yes. Can you tell me what your worst audition experience was? Uh, I auditioned for a war picture one time where they had no dialogue. I was just a soldier being shot at. So I went into this empty room and they said, okay, you're getting shot at, go. And I had to pretend like I was dodging bullets, and then they would say, oh, jump into a foxhole. And you just, all right. Now peek out from the foxhole, you know? Oh, you just stepped on a landmine. You lost your foot. You're bleeding out, You're getting tired, you know? Oh, a medic run over, he runs over to you. You're better now. Hobble, now find a tree, you know? Climb into a tank. All right. That kind of part? stuff. No, I didn't get the part. <laughs> I didn't get the part. <laughs>